Hello my fellow YouTubers and welcome back to my channel. My name is Daniel and I'm the host here. Um, today I'm going to talk about a couple of the uh, jackets that I wear while riding. And I know I haven't posted a video last Thursday but I was a little busy. So let's just jump into it. Number one is my Alpine Star Viper Air Jacket. Um, I liked this jacket when I bought it but I really don't wear it that often. Um, mainly because it's very tight fitting and I know the guy who sold it to me, he goes, you really wanna wear some tight fitting clothes uh, while you're riding, but I feel like this was excessively tight. Like I could have got a bigger size and been a little more comfortable. Uh, so it comes with a couple different features. It does have padding in the arms and the shoulder area. It also has a spot in the back for different stages of back protection as well. Uh, it is a mesh on the inside, so it does breathe a little bit better. But the thing that I have an issue with mesh is one of the arms I actually broke. So this arm, I broke the zipper on because the mesh on the inside of the zipper area, it got caught and I basically had to try to wiggle it back and forth and ended up breaking the zip zipper mechanism on the inside. Um, there is a removable vest, which I have in my truck, and I chose to take that out, but it really didn't help too well. I think it's got a, like a stage one back protector on it, and really doesn't help too much, but I feel like in the event of a crash, this jacket will hold up very well. I spent about $200 on this, and again, I loved this jacket in the beginning, but now I barely wear it. So, uh, it doesn't clean very well. The material is kind of weird. Uh, it's, I've tried to clean it. It just doesn't clean whatsoever. It gets really dirty and I, I don't really want to wear it out in public, especially when riding. Uh, not because I'm worried people are like, well, your jacket's dirty. No, I just don't like this jacket. Now we're going to move on to the two jackets that I do wear most often. And it's because it's cold in the morning and the mesh really, it breathes well, but it it's cold. So number one is my rain jacket, my rain uh, waterproof jacket that I got from Snap-on for free with purchase of tools when I was a mechanic. Uh, I actually love this jacket. It holds in heat very well, especially if you wear extra layers. Uh, it's got a bunch of internal pockets to keep things dry. And it's got the uh, nice material on the inside that's basically wiped clean. It's like, um, I forgot the name of that um, material. And then there's my favorite jacket that I love to wear. This very thick snap-on jacket. I've burnt this jacket multiple times on both my exhaust on my motorcycles. But it's very thick. Again, wear a couple layers underneath. It keeps you warm. Uh, it's not going to keep you completely warm in the winter. But um, it will keep you toasty. Uh, this sweatshirt, I actually love. It's very comfortable. Uh, it keeps me warm. I rode my bike once with it on. And although being that it was a little chillier, it doesn't keep you like warm warm but it is a very nice ride around throw on jacket or sweatshirt based charlotte sport bike network um i really appreciate it if people would uh subscribe to my channel i'm trying to reach fi uh, 500 subscribers by the end of the year and hopefully i can just grow my channel uh, and more mo uh, more motorcycle content will come when I pull my bike out of storage because it has been a little chilly and it sucks to ride in the early morning hours, especially when it's like 35 degrees. It's like a 24 degree wind chill. So, till next time, everybody. Deuces.